The last three grounded patches have all included adjustments to the infected broodmother's lair to prevent players from cheesing the fight. But if they want to stop me, they'll have to do it at least one more time. Because I cheesed her again. I'm sure there's not that many people left who want to watch another video on this, so while I jump up to my spot, I'm gonna share an opinion. I believe the best games that exist are always going to have ways to exploit them. It's nearly impossible to make a game that gives players a truly unique experience. An experience with multiple playstyles exciting game mechanics, room for creativity, you can't make that without leaving room for unintended strategies. The reason the infected broodmother fight was cheesed by me four times is because of the incredible care and detail that went into constructing her lair. Her lair is amazing. It isn't just a boring dome with no friction on the walls. It has a unique shape and decorations on the walls that aren't just visual. You can actually interact with them. The game itself has building materials that actually exist in the world. They can be thrown, stacked, and even climbed on. All these incredible details that make the game so special are the same details that made it possible to cheese the fight. That's my opinion anyway, and now that I'm tucked into my spot, the infected broodmother and I are both going to take the day off instead of fighting. You can watch the fight method in any of my other three videos if you want to know how it goes. See you next time!